In this video I like to review this Chinese digital microscope. The seller claims that this uh, microscope can obtain until uh, 1600 times. It arrives uh, with a little CD rond to install a driver. There is a zoom on there and if you turn you can make the screen very sharp. And there is a button here. And if you press this button it will store a picture. So if you zoom in on something and you want to have a picture of it you just press this little button. I bought this uh, microscope and I did like the microscope but I didn't like the stand. It was very difficult to work with. It has no uh, stability so I had to buy a standard, another standard but because they are so cheap I bought the whole package and this one has a thousand times lens on it and in this video I will show you examples of both and uh, we start with the, the 1000 after installing uh, the driver you get this software and this box is what the microscope is uh, filming and by turning you can zoom and it's not too bad. I'm looking to a, a micro print and as you can see now you see a uh, dirt on there and you cannot see that with your bare eyes. It's uh, a good thing to inspect the uh, electronics. It's very easy to focus and to find uh, the point to the place you want to go. And I think this is uh, yeah f four times of four times bigger than you can see with your uh, with your eye. In the box is uh, a a calibration card and with my eyes I cannot see the figures but with the microscope it's all right and if I press uh, on the photo button and you'll see up here that I made a picture I was uh, assuming that the microscope uh, would fit on the standard but it wasn't so I had to maintain it I drilled a hole in it and I made it fit and with the 1600 objective you enter a whole different world. For example this is uh, the grid we saw with the 1000. But now it's way more difficult to focus, to, to know where you actually are, where you're looking at and it is way harder to zoom in. On here we're looking to a leaf from a plant and you can see the cell. So with the 1600 times you really look inside the things. But it's it's hard to focus. It's hard to get a, a clear view. And this is what you see if I focus in on my skin. You can see our blood vessel over here. It's uh, fun to play around with. Uh, I recommend you not to buy one with this uh, cheap standard, but uh, to try to find a standard like this one. It's way better, with uh, more control focusing. If you need a close-up camera to inspect uh, things, like uh, electronic devices, go for the thousand times, because uh, the 1600 times is way out of line. It's impossible to focus on parts, but if you want to work on a, on a square millimeter, then it would be a good choice to buy the 1600. They both are not bad. They are very cheap, so I can recommend them. You have to learn to work with it, but they will do the job. Thanks for watching.